So far, y'all, um, we're touring a bunch of apartments today because your girl is on the hunt. Your girl's on the hunt, okay? I need a new place to stay. Um, the place I'm at is cute. Loved it. It was great for its purpose, but it's time to move on. So we're trying to find the next place we're going to call home. I got my little folder of information. We're about to tour, I think, like three different apartments today. I'm excited. I really like this one. I think this one and... The second one we're seeing my favorite. Okay. This apartment has two buildings, building one and building two. Our apartment that we were looking at or interested in is in building one. We're in building two right now, and building two is the one with the parking garage. They have the amenity split. You need key fobs to get everywhere, like actually it, it works. The key fob's not broken, okay? <laughs> but this is the pool and the rooftop deck. View of the Georgia Aquarium, Coca Cola town. The pool is cute. This is a really cute area. They got a fireplace, cornhole. Get us into the pool, baby. This is so cute, y'all. <gasps> the view. Who do y'all know? So then we come over here. There's more parking garages there. I got my puffer on now, y'all, but it's getting warm back in Atlanta, so I'm gonna need me a little pool. Cause the pool in my apartment now be closed 90% of the time. I don't know what's going on. That, like the actual room that we're interested in is still has someone living in it. So, but they're moving out, obviously. We won't be able to actually tour the exact apartment that we want to. Would it be ground or one? Ground, right? Yeah. Okay, we're about to go see the pet spa. But like I was saying, the exact apartment that we want is an available tour. So we're touring um, an apartment like it, um, just to get an idea. It has the same color concept and all stuff. The one that we want to see just bigger. So there's a mail room on both in both buildings, but this is what the mail room look like. So this is where you could groom her, wash her. And then there's like, oh my gosh, she has a treadmill. She can run on the treadmill. I'm dead. This smells really good. Here is the Wi-Fi lounge. It's like a working home area. I really like looking at something similar. Okay. 
This is the color scheme, the dark wood, the tile. This is beautiful. This has lots of storage space. Lots of storage space. The kitchen. I love the tile. Look at the back. Storage space when it comes to the washer and dryer. Again, this is the oven. This is the living room area. I think this is the first. I don't know which bedroom is which, but I'm sure we'll be able to tell. This is the, this is the, the guest. guest. Yeah, this is the guest. Ah, huh? dark. Okay, it's got a little entrance walkway when you first walk in. Breaks off into the bathroom. Which our bathroom wouldn't have the shower. In the apartment we're gonna have, it's gonna have a glass shower. So the bathroom, and it'll also be double vanity. So like I said, this is 300 to 400 square feet smaller than the unit that we're interested in. So keep that in mind. It's a very big bathroom. And I will say this apartment does seem like a little bit on the older side, but again, it's been renovated, so. The bathroom goes all the way from here, all the way over there. So it's the corner room, it's the biggest balcony. But y'all see what I mean by like, it's giving very much in our business because I can see everybody's balcony. But with that being said, our balcony to the apartment that we like, it'll be facing the street. It won't be in our balcony, so again, this is not the balcony that we came to tour. This is not, I mean, the apartment that we came to tour. So ours will be street view. It'll have a really pretty view, the sunset, everything. But it's just not available to be tour right now. But it's still very cute in here. Um, yeah, with that being said, we're probably gonna move on to apartment number two. I'll see you guys there. We have an appointment at two o'clock. It's one, so. And we have a true rooftop pool. Those other places that tell you they have a rooftop yeah, pool and it's that be like on the sixth floor, that's <laughs> not a rooftop pool. Mm -hmm. Because if apartments can look at your pool, it's not a rooftop mm -mm. pool. Like here, you see nothing but a gun. Adding a brand new TV out here with a lot more outdoor games mm -hmm. um, and a lot more furniture as well, too. So nice. All of this renovation is taking progress. And you see the Trader Joe's right there? Mm hmm. We got more. This is a master. This is tough. See this shower. Mm hmm. Stop. This is beautiful. I'm sure they're trying to control all this, but this So this is one of the areas. It's got a fire pit. I really like this one, y'all. Um, this is pretty big area. I mean, when I be thinking, first of all, it smells really good in here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so here's the washer and dryer, off the kitchen. Some more storage. I love this, babe. I love this. Right off the entrance of the door. That is beautiful. Coats, shoes everything i love this kitchen like the brown with the white like this shade of brown too is really nice i love a good gas stove this is beautiful clean stainless steel i think this is the master or is this the guest no this is the master no this is the master he thought he saw the master this the master this is beautiful look at the tub <laughs> I'm in there, bitch. Like, oh, okay, yes. Yeah, <laughs> like, this it's nice. Like, it's no. no. So yes. now we're gonna go see the guests, and it's not even gonna be. Both of them have two fucking sinks. They right? do. Yeah. But it only has a shower on the other one, not no shower in the tub. Mm. 
So yeah. this is nice, closet space. This is beautiful. Look at the shower and tub combo. Hey, how big this is. Y'all aren't seeing how big this is, but this is big. Like for Atlanta too. Look at this closet. Y'all, this closet is deep. Oh, this is beautiful. This little nook, I'm gonna put my laptop over here. This could be like a little study area, couch. All right, this is the guest room, still big. Oh, this is beautiful. I would've thought this was the main too. It's got a bigger shower, but it ain't got a tub. It got a bigger closet too. This might be the, no, this can't be the master. No, this is not the master, because the It can't have a tub. It can't have a tub. The other one can't have a tub, not the master. So this is the, yeah, this is definitely, because the room itself is smaller too. Yeah. This is definitely the guest room. This would be our office nice, space, second nice. bedroom. But this is beautiful, y'all. I love the kitchen. I'm in love with everything. Love room. And there's roof access, which we'll go on in a second. But oh, look at these little chisling chairs. Please, I'm gonna be using a private area. And then this is, there's a bunch of little balconies. The bigger one, this is like a little private one. But I would definitely come out here. See like, in my apartment now, I don't use the amenities because they're not good. <laughs> like I don't want to use them, it's like low, nothing. Yeah, so the one we just saw is on the ninth floor. She said the one that we would get is the exact same layout but on the 11th floor, better view, higher up. So, that wouldn't be bad. I would love that. This is TVs. Well, this pool better than the other pool. I was just talking when I was seeing the other place. This is actually nice. Look at little waterfalls. Everything. And then there's a little sitting area on the other side. The sitting area. Look at the fairy lights and more sitting area. Oh, that she turned it on. Oh, that's right. Um, my camera just turned off, I was right. But, yesterday was Monday, and they posted it Monday, yesterday. My dumbass went yesterday, and the shit said Taco Tuesday on the top. <laughs> so I went to location, and I was like, where is everybody? So I dragged my man out the house. <laughs> Nothing. But, part two, dragging him out the house again, because now it is Tuesday, and now they are there. So now we're going back. Step done, pull up from the three. Like Stefan and the cool bar headed like the other. Okay, are we here? It's like a pop up shop place, so they be, they be moving. Anyways, it's raining. Hi. Good, how are you? Can we do um, one garlic butter shrimp taco? And then can I do two beef tacos? And a side of yellow rice? So 13. Okay, y'all, we made it back into the car. Um, she said she's gonna call us whenever our order is ready. It's 3.20 right now. There's not a lot of people here, um, but we're gonna see how long it takes. All right, one shrimp, two beef, and rice? Yes. Have a great Thank one. you so much. You're more than welcome. Yes, yeah, it took like eight minutes. Yeah, my phone's not bad, but also nobody's here. Oh, it was raining. Hey, y'all, look at this rice. Tell me why this rice looks so good look how seasoned it is like this looks good i thought it was gonna be some bs i'm not gonna lie but that shit looks good look. back up no that's why i thought you didn't want no rice i thought you ain't want no rice you trying to find a fork you got your onion and cilantro and then my consomme here on the side of course is it good stop <laughs> okay y'all i'm gonna bust down before he eat on my food Okay, y'all, so I've decided I'm gonna do a little mukbang, like a little mukbang section, session, segment. I think that's worth it. It's not what you expect. It's not like, this is good. This almost tastes Chinese. Like, there's definitely like soy sauce and teriyaki sauce in that. But in the best way possible, like it's good. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. But you're making me hungry. <laughs> Last bite. Ooh, beautiful. Squeeze a little bit more lime. You can't use that. It has beef in it. He's pescatarian. Seven point seven. All right, y'all. So this is how it looks right now. There's a lot of cheese actually at the bottom in the back, but you gotta put on your cilantro and stuff, you know. And I don't play about the lime. So this is what it looks like now. That looks a lot better. You wanna go in with the lime? I love lime. Like. I rate the rice. I feel like it tastes Chinese. Like it tastes like some Chinese food. But the rice is good. I still give it like, it's like soft. It's really good. It's a lot of flavor. I'll give it like an eight. What do you think? Like a 6.5. Mm. It's smooth though, it's good. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's your favorite taco so far? Mm. I think I've had better beer, but this is good for like giving two dollar tacos. It's good. I think it just needs to be more seasoned. But probably give it a good solid six point five. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to like the tacos like falling apart. Mmm. It's raining out today, y'all. My hair, I just washed it this morning, it didn't last. Mm. 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 Oh, no. This is what it feels like I'm eating a whole separate dish. <laughs> like, it's a whole different flavor palette. She does like to be in someone's lap. And like get a higher view. I'm making my other taco right now. Getting the line. She likes to be in someone's lap. Like she's definitely a lap dog for one. But she's also scared to be. I don't know. Girl, this girl is so confusing. She'd be scared at first. But she really does like being picked up. If she's somewhere new, she would rather be in someone's lap. But she likes having a higher view. So she likes being on the bed. She likes being in someone's lap when I'm like doing stuff up here. But she be in the way. Mm-mm. Her big self, she be nosy, so she be trying to look. What is that? Her show. What show is that? <clears throat> Y'all should be watching Bluey by force. I was putting it on. Much like it. At least nice that she can see other dogs. Even if they're hard to. But she has been watching, um, She's been watching Love is Blind with me. Have y'all been watching Love is Blind? Girl. Girl, T, okay? If you haven't, I'm not gonna spoil. But, you need to watch it. If you're watching it, skip this part of the video. But, I haven't finished it because, um, not all the episodes have come out, but, we haven't watched the finale or the reunion yet, where I am right now, today. Okay. Not the best period I've ever had, but very good. I haven't even seen who was even making it to get married. They're just now picking out their wedding dresses. All our couples right now, they're still together. I will say after the lake party, okay? If you know, you know. I knew we're gonna last, except for that one couple. And you know what couple I'm talking about. With old boy, who should've picked old girl. Jess, but okay, I don't remember his name because he makes me mad and I be skipping every time they show their couple because they make me mad. But 
black couple. I love them so much. Um, A, I love AD so much. She's my favorite for obvious reasons. The other couple, I forget their names. It's the Hispanic girl and the white guy. They're so cute together. They're definitely the strongest couple. Um, what's her name? Was not joking when she said that shit at the lake party. She was like, oh, they're the strongest couple. And then her man got mad. Like, why would you say they're the strongest couple? Obviously, we are the strongest couple. They're not. They're far from the strongest couple. They're like the least strong couple. And he always be like, we're the best couple. We're the best couple. Y'all are the worst couple, actually. Who gives you the right to like judge someone on there? Because show? I have the right because they went on to a fucking TV show and put their business out there. So as the people who are paying them, the viewers, because they get paid. Well, they don't get paid like from watching. But you know what I mean. We watching the show. We the reason the show still on. Okay. So we get to judge. Now I will say people be taking it overboard and be forgetting that these are real life people. And that this is recorded like a year ago. Like this has been a year since this shit has happened to them. Like uh, we're just not watching this, but all this shit happened last year, last summer. Like we're not up to date at all, okay? So I do be hate when people be like, arr, 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 unless they be like telling them about themselves. Cause oh boy, if y'all have watched the Lake Day thing, that man was on them jet skis quick as fuck. And that shit took me clean out. I felt so bad for old girl. But I knew that they were not gonna last. I knew they were not gonna last since they went to the fucking honeymoon shit. Like, when they showed them, I don't remember their names. But when they showed them in the pool, and y'all know who I'm talking about when I said jet skis, y'all. If you watch the show, you already know who I'm talking about. But I did not, I knew from the first day when they were um, at the, in the, at the retreat, it is a night scene, they were at the pool. And he was doing too much. He was like playing in the pool. And he was like, okay, it was his personality. Okay, cool. But like, she, you could tell it was too much for her. Like she was not fucking with him. Like, and she was just looking at him like, uh -huh, uh -huh. like she literally laughed like that. She was like, uh -huh. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, she does not fuck with him. And he was engaged a month before going on a show where you get married. Anyways, I'm ready for the reunion because now that they've seen confessionals, they've seen all the tea. I want to just see the reunion to see what they said to each other. Like, was there tussling? Because uh, if it was baddies, they would have been tussling. But you know, there. That has nothing to do with it, but it's also like not that kind of show. See. But, but on the lake scene, when AD was talking to old girl, yeah, she, she, she ate her up. Matthew was a mess. Can we talk about that? I was so scared that AD was going to pick that man. I was shaking in my motherfucking boots. And the only reason I wasn't that scared was because I had seen um, the thumbnails for the next episodes and I seen that Clay and AD were together but I was still shaking in my boots because I was like what if she chooses Matthew and not Clay and that would have been a whole different show. Hi mama. Hi mama Luna. Hi little baby. Hello. Hello. Let me get a napkin. She always be having I believe. I believe. Luna 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 Luna. She's hyper. That's pretty much it. I just wanted to stop by and say hey one more time. Um, I really do miss you guys and be expecting more content soon.